are going hey guys we are going to looking at this problem here so explain why the radius of convergence of the summation goes from 0 to infinity x to the n factorial is less than or equal to 1 so we are going to discuss this problem so let's apply ratio test right so what is the ratio ratio test right uh all right this one here uh x to the power n factorial right let's apply ratio test so a a n plus one divided by a n not right is equal to x to the n plus 1 factorial divided by x n factorial so when you simplify this bit you get x uh, yeah all modulus get n times n factorial everything modulus right well this one is same with this one is same with this one is same with x mod of n n factorial right so from the ratio test right the if from the ratio test uh, uh, if if uh, mod x mod of x less than 1 then this ratio a n a n plus 1 divided with a n goes to 0 as as and tends to infinity otherwise if if mod of x greater than 1 that ratio a sub n plus 1 divided by a n goes to infinity as n tends to infinity right that means that power series this power series is divergent if modulus x modulus of x is less than 1 that power series is convergent right and uh, what about x equals 1 and x equals 1 and minus 1 clearly so when when x equals plus or minus 1 definitely Definitely, this series is divergent. That series, that series is divergent. Is divergent. So, so we can conclude that if 
mod of x less than 1 that series is convergent so the radius the radius the radius the radius of that power series must be less than or equal to 1 